Sanders Park Elementary School, Pompano Elementary School, Pompano Middle, and Pompano Beach High School. I think it was a wonderful education, and, um, and not only academically, but also socially. Um, going from um, a predominantly black school in elementary school to a predominantly white school in elementary school was uh, quite a different uh, aspect on life, but it kind of reinforced uh, a lot of things I was being taught at home anyway. Uh, through faith and by my parents that uh, color of the skin was really not that important. The most important thing was how a person was on the inside. Uh, high school was wonderful. Um, entered in high school uh, both an athlete and uh, kind of a scholar uh, per se, a little bit ahead of some of my peers, but ninth grade was very exciting. Uh, was able to participate in building a bonfire for homecoming to help with that and was three stories tall so that was that was quite an exciting experience. I, I played uh, basketball, ran track, and but mostly football was my thing. Well, I, I think it, I think it's vitally, it was vitally important to me because it opened so many doors and so many avenues for me to do so many things, go a number of places I probably never would have had an opportunity to, to do. And today, with kids today, they have to understand that uh, whether it's a secondary degree or just going back to a trade school, getting some sort of credentials is going to be a lifelong benefit for them and their family and the future of their families. Well, I, I just, I truly believe that everybody has a role that they can play. And it may not be the same for everyone, but I think that everyone can either provide mentorship, um, assist financially, but also just being aware of exactly what's going on in the field of education so that way they can kind of go back and make some changes and help to guide things in a way that they should go. Whether it be with their politician friends or people they don't know, but I just think that um, everybody can play a role and it may not be the same. I, you know, my parents have gone back after retirement, they volunteer at schools, elementary schools, but whether it's directly at school and then we developed a tutoring program at my church. So I think there's just so many ways that everyone can help I've always said that I just want to be a servant leader and, and kind of do some things that I'm passionate about. But it's also nice to have someone to recognize that you're trying to provide insight to kids. And a lot of times, even in the classes, they get tired of me going on and on because I would tell them I'm not a math teacher, I'm a life teacher. So, you know, I just want to be able to help them in all the different ways. And if they have questions, they'll feel that they can always come to me and ask.